Government keeping its commitment to support and fund small businesses across the country. Minister of Finance, Deputy Prime Minister, the Honorable Peter Turnquest, revealing the details during a virtual press conference that in just one year, he has no doubt that the Access Accelerator has had the single greatest impact on advancing the development of micro and small businesses in the Bahamas than any institution. In the coming year, the Access Accelerator intends to focus on funding and, and business development support in the following industries, fishing and farming, with particular attention on value added processing, something that has eluded us. Bahamian owned vacation home rentals and small scale tourism projects. We know that the new tourism market is geared towards boutique type uh, resorts, small properties with low density, high experience quality. We believe that we have a tremendous opportunity uh, to expand and exploit this market uh, with Bahamian ownership, uh, thereby spreading the risk, uh, uh, particularly during this uh, COVID-19 time when people are looking for more low, low scale, low, low scale uh, projects, properties. Information and, community and communications technology, alternative energy, and energy efficiency, the orange economy or creative and cultural ventures and manufacturing. Quest announced that a $55 million investment in the Small Business Development Program will also assist entrepreneurs operating in non-traditional sectors who often have difficulty accessing entrepreneurial support. This is most needed currently for the task to recover from the ongoing crisis depends on creativity, determination, and grit of, sm of the small business community. The entrepreneurs who come out of the Access Accelerator will no doubt help to diversify the economy as more persons get involved and explore non-traditional business. The Access Accelerator is the government's tangible de demonstration of commitment to small business and to create opportunities to materialize wealth in non-traditional sectors of the economy.